you're a fan of everything. Robbie describes it as like a hole that you have to fill. So once one fandom is kind of quiet, and now you have to fill it with something new. Um, so Robbie actually introduced me to Avatar lately. Um, so I'm a bit obsessed with that. Um, yeah, we've been actually we've been spotting uh, Avatar costumes as they come. It was a bit embarrassing at Melbourne. We saw a guy dressed as uh, an airbag. And I like whistled at him and like, pulled him over because it was sort of a con in reverse. We were like, come here, come here, you're really cool. Um, and we, we had to figure out whether he was Anne as a grown man or Tenzin. And she had Anne and I had Tenzin. He said, I'm Tenzin over Anne. He's anyway. niche, so come on. Um, so, yeah, so we've seen, we've seen a few of you guys dressed as Avatar characters, so we've been geeking out over that. But, but that's, I think that's kind of one of the things about doing this. The, there's very little difference between you guys and us. Um, we're, kind of, we're kind of all the same. Uh, so yeah, we can cat about stuff all the time. Yeah, and I'm a big fan of Hunger Games. I love it. And, and we both watch Game of Thrones religiously. Every, I like Game of Thrones, but I have, to, I have a sweater that I have to watch it through because I hate blood and everything. But it's so good, so I just want my sweater pulled up. <laughs> you kind of know would, you, would you please tell her to read the books? superior and smug in the corner going, I know what's exactly. coming next. <laughs> you like that character? He's gonna die. <laughs>